Hey guys, good morning, good morning. We are in Pompeii and we have got an epic travel vlog for you because not only are we traveling to Naples and then to Rome, but we're going back to Canada yes. via Lisbon. Uh -huh. So we're going to show you the entire journey and we're starting off on a regional train. What's that train called again? Okay, I so we're at say. station Circum Vesuviana. Yes. And we don't know when it's coming because today is day two of that holiday, yeah. the Feast of the Immaculate Conception, and everything's shut down. Yeah, so hopefully we'll get on a train soon. It's going to be a tight connection with our other train, which goes yeah. from Naples to Rome. And we're going to be staying overnight. Yeah. And then the following morning we, we pick up uh, with the flights. Yes. So anyways, we're going to be starting off on a train, ending with a German Shepherd dog, Togo. Yes. We can't My wait family to see dog. Togo. We're going to be hanging out in Audrey's um, family house for a while in Brampton. Yeah. Brampton, Canada, which is just like on the outskirts of Toronto. Jeez, you're just putting my neighborhood <laughs> out there. Okay. <laughs> All it's right. A big, it's a big city, I'm sure. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, yeah, we've got a busy travel day. So, yeah, let's get it started. Okay. Jesus. <laughs> I'm having cotoleta con patate. Which is what? Um, some kind of cutlet and potatoes. Yeah. And we're so hungry. We're so hungry. One thing I forgot to mention was uh, the price of the regional train was 280 euros, right? 280, yes. Yeah. yeah. And so it took about 45 minutes. No, closer to 50 minutes. But it's we wait. We, 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 yeah, we waited just that same amount of time for it to yeah. arrive because of yeah. the holiday. And then it took the same amount of time we waited for us to get there by train. So, yes. so yeah, we don't here. we don't have quite as much time to spare, but yeah, we have enough, enough time for lunch. Enough time. Always time for food. Guys. Always time for food. Yeah. All right, time to try four cheese gnocchi and quattro fromage. Yeah. And this is actually a starter portion because mm -hmm. it's meant to be the first dish. Mm. It's pretty good for train station food. Yeah. Oh yeah, you can taste that cheese. Like, but you're right, the portion's not big. I have a feeling we'll be need, we'll probably load, grab a sandwich before we get And pastries for you. Ooh, thank you. Buon appetito. Oh, grazie. Mm -hmm. And this is mine. I got the cotoletta with potatoes. Oh. This looks great. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, oh, oh. I wonder what kind of cutlet this is. Yeah, what do you think? Question. Chicken? Pork? I don't really know. We have a hat. Oh, it's really yeah. fresh out of the oven. Can you guess what it is? I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> I, you're suffering. That's what we know. That's what we know. You're suffering. Get some of that water. Get some of that Pellegrino in you. <laughs> Waiting to board now. What did you get? Another more food. Pastries. More food. Euros worth of pastries, and then lunch at the restaurant was fourteen euros already. Yeah. So not, not bad. Not, not just any pastries. Let's take a look. Show us what's inside. Okay, I got the sfogliatella, which yeah. is the local specialty, shaped oh. like a shell, and also a croissant filled with Nutella. Oh yeah, that'll tie us over until we get to Rome. This is all mine. You said you didn't want pastries. Oh, you're gonna be sharing. Don't worry. The, uh, invoking the Audrey Dessert Act.
welcome to Roma. It's a big terminal here, guys. <laughs> I'm tired. Um, we're about 20 minutes late, and we're just gonna go find our hotel. I think chill the rest of the night. So we'll take you to the hotel. I'll probably say goodbye and pick it up again tomorrow. All right, guys. So we've made it to Rome, yeah. and Sam is just immediately passing out in the I'm bed. Chilling, guys. Kind of hit the wall. So, yeah. 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 <laughs> it's been a long day. Oh my gosh. I don't know why, but like traveling by train can be really tiring, even though I you're just, just sitting there. I think we've had about like. 13 or 14 really busy travel days in a row. Yeah, I think I just hit the wall today I'm like really tired. Yeah, really but tired. we arrived at the hotel and we got a free upgrade We're in like the penthouse suite yeah. um, And I mean it's a pretty budget hotel because we only paid 40 euros a night and that is really cheap for Rome uh, But we thought we'd give you a tour so bedroom right there um, Nightstand some lights the We've got a little desk the, area. The standout feature is the balcony though. We got a balcony. Balcony, yeah. So let's go. It's starting to get dark out. Sunset already happened. But this is it. That's like the quickest room tour ever. Bathroom's a bathroom, you don't need to see that one. Oh, so yeah. the plan now is food. Food. Okay, well, we'll take you along for dinner. I lied before, I said we're gonna call it a day, but we're gonna go for dinner. Okay, so, let's We'll take eat. you out for dinner. <laughs> Thanks for following, guys. <laughs> oh my gosh. You look like a beached whale right I, now. I show, us, show us that pose again. I feel or like, like a one. seal or something. I feel like one. Yeah. I'm running on empty. <laughs> All right, let's go get some food. Food has arrived. What did you get? I got spaghetti alla carbonara. Oh, of course you did. Our food ended up at someone else's table by accident. Yeah. But it finally found its way to us. That's right. Thankfully. 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 Oh my goodness. This looks right. good. Apologies for the oranges light, guys. Am I orange? We're a little bit orange. The food looks a little orange. Mm. Just the lighting in here. Mm -hmm. It's night. Mm -hmm. I'm eating my hair, yeah. That's a bit gross. Well, is it good? Mm -hmm. It's the spot? It's tasty. <laughs> it's tasty. How about yours? I'll try it. I'll okay, try it. So I ordered the Diavola pizza, which is like a margarita, except it has picante salami added to it. Mm -hmm. So And no basil. No and basil. no olive oil drizzled oh, all over. True. So really. Yeah, this is not this is not Naples quality. <laughs> That's for sure. I can tell that already. Mm. So much for taking mm. a break from pizza. That didn't happen. <laughs> no, well, it's my last chance, so. Enjoy it. It's decent. But man, when you've been having pizza in Naples, you've been sure spoiled, so. Nowhere near that quality, but uh, it, it'll certainly pass for tonight. All right, let's enjoy. I'm enjoy. hungry. Guys, it's a new day. Good We've said goodbye to the trains and now we are going to be flying. It's a day of flying. Yeah, actually, we were planning on taking the train to the airport, yeah. but then we got to the station and we noticed all these airport buses parked right here. Right. And it's less than half the price. And it only takes 45 minutes as yeah. opposed to what is it like 20 or 30 by train? Right. So, so the, we're like, yeah. the the bus tickets are six euros and the train five tickets are 12. Nine, or five ninety. Save those 10 cents. And on top of that, it's only 15 minutes longer on the bus, so we have the time, so we will save the money. Lights, cameras, action. We haven't done an update in a while. Time at the airport. I feel like we only film when we're eating. <laughs> yeah, we've done a little, the camera comes little, out. little bit bad with the B roll on this video. Anyways, <laughs> we arrived at the airport. What was it? Fiumicino? Something with it. Yeah. Fiumicino, right? 
right? Yeah. Um, so it's yeah. the main international one. Yeah, it was a 45 minute ride. Yeah. Little traffic on a Sunday. We've already checked in. And yeah. And now we're having some lunch. So we saved 12 euros on transportation. The bus was a good option, by the way, yeah. especially on a Sunday when it wasn't that busy. Uh, we got there quickly, like 40 minutes, 45 minutes at most. Mm -hmm. We saved 12 euros. How much was yours? This? Yes. Oh, Do you remember? This is five something. This, my pizza, my very last pizza in Italy, oh, so sad, was just under eight. So basically, by taking the bus, we got ourselves a free lunch almost. So, pretty cool. How was it? Good. I got myself the bufalino. Yeah. So it's a sandwich with the thin buffalo. Yeah. I wonder if it is like buffalo cheese or maybe buffalo is like the Italian word for cow, girl, we know. But anyways, yeah. It's buffalo, prosciutto, and a panini. Is it good? Mm -hmm. Yeah. And so our first flight today is going to be with TAP. We are going from Liz from Rome. <laughs> We're not in Lisbon yet. We're going from Rome to Lisbon. So yeah, that'll be the short one. And hopefully we make our connection for the international flight back to Toronto. Fingers crossed. Our domestic flight has been delayed by 20 minutes already, which is not good news because we already have a tight connection. But we'll see. We shall see. I was lured into this gelato shop by like a flowing a chocolate, chocolate fountain. Fountain. Right in front yeah. of us. We're and, like, yeah, and they have amazing looking gelato. So I got you three flavors: strawberry, mango, and caramel. Try it, because I have a dripping cone. So okay. th this okay. needs to be expedited. Caramel. Mm. And here's my cone, and I will be eating that very quickly too. Just you probably just saw a drip. It's gourmet, dripping gourmet right now. So we're gonna end this taste test. Just know that it's very good. And then I've got gelato on my fingers. We owe you the biggest update. Oh my gosh, we, oh. we didn't film the second leg of the journey, the flight from Lisbon to Toronto. Because first of all, we barely got on the plane. I'd say a we minute. We were the last people. We were the last like, people. Perfect. But we made it. We yeah, our, our, made our first it. flight was late. We had the craziest, tightest connection to begin with. Yeah. And then we, I don't know how we made it. Like we. <laughs> I barely even remember what happened, but we, we somehow got on. Because there was no line at immigration. Yeah. That's the only reason we made it on. And the last flight, we were just so exhausted and we were and like it was in so the middle. Turbulent. It was like oh, three yeah. hours of turbulence. Back to back, like super, tur back to back, super turbulent flights. Like that was white knuckle grip. Like basically the seatbelt signs were on both of those time. flights almost the whole time. Yeah. So. So it wasn't fun. But it wasn't fun, home. but we're here. Home. Back in the motherland. Waiting for the luggage to see Canada. the luggage made. That's the yeah. question. It's a good chance it didn't. Fingers crossed. But we're getting so close to ending this vlog because we promised you we would show you the Togo the oh dog. God. And that is the end. The end is near, guys. 